Can I have green in my teeth? No. Okay. Just checking. It's actually really good. We should eat that for lunch. I'm Nicole. Welcome to the Produce Made Simple Kitchen. Produce Made Simple is your go-to resource for all things fruits and veg. Today we're making an awesome green goddess salad dressing. Lots of recipes online for this include sour cream or mayonnaise to get that creaminess that everybody loves, but we're going to use a ripe avocado instead. So when you go to the grocery store, if you want to get a ripe one right away, you need to look for one that's darker. Uh, the ones that are green are not yet ripe. Another tip is to sort of give it gentle pressure with your thumb. The ones that are not ripe will be very hard, but the ones that are ripe will give gently to pressure. Please don't upset your produce manager though and give them all a hard squeeze because you'll bruise them all. The other thing you want to look for is the stem. When they're not ripe, the stem won't come out easily, but when they're ripe, it pops out quite easily. To cut an avocado, a lot of people will just hold it and score it and go around, but in case you're not that confident with a knife, we're just going to do it on the board. So it's good just to keep everything steady, go all the way around, and then to remove the pit, you just twist it and pull them apart. To take the pit out, a lot of people will just kind of hit it with a knife and twist, uh, but again, just to be careful here, we're gonna just kind of go around it and pick it out. When it's ripe, you'll see it comes out super easy. When the avocado is ripe, the skin will peel off very easily. So now I'm just gonna pop these into the food processor. So the thing I love best about this recipe is that you can kind of use a variety of flavors that you love best. The whole point is it's called the green goddess because you use a variety of green vegetables. Um, I've chosen two herbs that I love, parsley and cilantro. Um, I also chose uh, the tops of green onions instead of chives because I had those left over from a salad I made last night where I used just the white part. So again, this is kind of an approximate, but you just kind of like, you can just tear it and stick it in. We also have some fresh lemon juice. Some other options if you don't have this, um, some people online, you can see that they use other things like apple cider vinegar. We really prefer fresh ingredients here at Produce Made Simple. Um, another option could be fresh lime juice. That's about a tablespoon. And the green onion. Again, this is kind of about a half a cup. Some freshly ground salt and pepper. So I've got some olive oil here. And this is really just for consistency. So if you wanted it to be quite thick, you wouldn't add as much oil. Um, and if you want it to be more like a dressing, then you'd add, this is about a cup. So we're gonna just see, we're gonna add a little bit now and see how it goes. Okay, the color of this looks amazing. So let's give it a little try and see how thick it is. You might wanna add a little bit more oil. Okay, so that's more like a dip than a salad dressing. We're gonna just add a little bit more oil just to thin it down. Let's give it another try. Okay, still pretty thick. Mmm, amazing. You can totally taste the creaminess of the avocado. Really blended well with like um, the two different herbs. There's not one flavor that overpowers the other. So uh, I think it's perfect. We're gonna keep this one a little bit thicker because I'm gonna massage it into a kale salad. But if you want it a bit thinner, you can add a bit more oil or even a little bit of water. For the full recipe, please check out the link in the description below or on our website, producemadesimple.ca. And please like, comment, and subscribe for more Produce Made Simple. Thanks for watching. Hi, I'm Nicole. Welcome to the Produce Made Simple kitchen. Today, nope. Hi. <laughs> Just a sec. It's quiet. <laughs> it's good. I totally eat this all day long. Please like, comment, <laughs> For more, just, just, just shake it out. Just shake it out. <laughs>